Welcome guys to the Crazy Hands Knitting and Crocheting channel. In this video tutorial I want to show you how to knit this beautiful, cute and really super simple baby turban that is knitted flat and has only knit and curl stitches. So perfect project for beginners. Of course you may decorate your turban with a bow. Uh, this is knit bow, you can crochet it. Check video tutorial for this bow on my blog. I will leave a link down. As an option, you, you may buy and decorate your turban with a brooch. Maybe a little bit smaller for the baby on this one. And I've done the second version, so that's how it looks. So this turban will be perfect for girls and boys. And you decide how you're going to decorate it. For the knot, for the imitation of the knot. So you will see how to do it at the end of this video. So you can attach this knot. And it will look perfect for, of course, boys and girls. Just change the color look how beautiful this little lady is i like her so much <laughs> cute little baby so this is front this is back really looks cute and you may of course need an adult version if you want i will show you how to do it just write me a comment for this tutorial I'm using medium weight yarn from loop, loops and thread. You will need about 30-40 grams for this turban and um, I was using uh, 3.5 millimeters knitting needles. You may use circular needles or straight needles, whatever you have. And for the knot, I was using double pointed needles because here you will need to knit in rounds. Otherwise, you can knit back and forth and then make a seam to form a cylinder and then roll it. I think I said everything. So if you are ready, now I want to tell you about calculations. So let's start with my gauge. My gauge is 16 stitches per 10 centimeters. That means 1.6 stitches in one centimeter. So head circumference of my baby is 40, 41 centimeters. It's a little bit bigger than a newborn. So 40 by 1.6 equals 46 stitches. Then I always subtract 10 or 15% to make the head fit even better and I've got 54.4 or 54 stitches. Please pay attention, the number of stitches has to be even. So we know about length, 54 stitches, and about height, you can find this information in the internet, the height for the baby's head, so I'm giving you for 0, 3 months, 13 centimeters, then 3, 6 months, 14 centimeters, then 6, 18 months, 15 and 5, and up to 3 years old, 18 centimeters. More information you can find in the internet. Otherwise, leave me a comment and I will help you. So for my head, height 13 centimeters will be perfect, but as you see, the head is really stretchy. So you decide whether you stretch it and then you measure it or you don't stretch it as uh, I will do and take the height less than, than needed. So instead of 13, the height will be 10 or 11 centimeters. So let's write it. 11 or 10. You will see at the end I will measure it for you. So the same for three, for six months instead of 14, take 11, 12 centimeters. I hope it's clear. So let's get started. 
using long tail cast on method and 3.5 mm knitting needles cast on 54 stitches. It is also nice if you have tail at the end at least 20 centimeters. Please pay attention that now we are on the wrong side. And the first row knit all stitches. Slip the first stitch and knit all other stitches till the end. Please go on knitting till the last stitch. At the end, throw the last stitch, salvage stitch, turn. Row number two, slip the first stitch and purl all stitches. Go on till the end, throw the last salvage stitch as well and turn. Row number three, slip the first stitch and knit all stitches. Please go on till the end. After that, purl one more row. So I've done in total four rows in stocking at stitch. And now row number five. Slip the first stitch and again purl all stitches. You were purling row number four and purl all stitches in row number 5. Please go on and finish. Turn row number 6. Slip the first stitch and knit all stitches. Please finish knitting all stitches, purl the last sewing stitch, then row number 7, purl all stitches, and row number 8, knit all stitches again. So knit in total 8 rows, and I will see you after. So that's what I have at this moment, and from this point we start to repeat everything from the first row. Row number 9 will be the same as row number 1, knit all stitches. So finish knitting this row, then purl the next row, then knit, then purl again. So go on repeating last 8 rows until you reach desired length. I will knit in total 40 rows. So I'm going to repeat uh, my 8 rows 5 times in total. So here I am and that's what I have. Let's measure the width. So it's about 30, 
332 centimeters or 12 and a half inches the size for newborn the head is stretched itself as i said so when i measure it's about 10 and a half centimeters or four four and a half inches now we will seam the top part for this we hold turban this is the right side so we we fold it wrong side out and we are going to use three needles band of method for this you divide all stitches in half now i divide just roughly and you will you will need one more needle to help yourself if you know any other nice method please feel free to use it now let's knit together the first stitch on the first needle and the first stitch on the second needle so knit them together and drop both stitches of the needle repeat again insert the needle into the first stitch then into the second one and knit two together drop both stitches of the needle and now slip the first stitch over the second one for this you may use the second needle or i mean back needle or front needle up to you and let's repeat again knit two together drop and slip over let's do it again insert into the first into the second knit both stitches together and slip over knit slip over let's do it again first second knit two together slip over first stitch second stitch knit two together drop and pass over so i hope it's clear let's look at the right side so beautiful seam please go on seaming till the end so here the top the crown and now we need to join this part for this if you have at the beginning tail that's nice you may use it if you don't have it just attach a new one no worries now pick up front loop of each salvage stitch in this way front loop front loop front loop You may use also hook if you don't have yarn or, or tapestry needle. Pull through in the second part.
pull through and a little bit more. And pull through two. Now pull tight and form your two then. Pull the tail on the wrong side and pull again as much as you can, but be careful not to break your working yarn. Let's make a knot. And give in ends. Your turban is ready. Look how great it is. I really like how it looks. So here is the seam. And for the knot imitation, if you want, you will need four double pointed needles same size or you can take three millimeters holding two needles together let's cast on one two three four five six seven eight nine ten 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Let's cast on two more. 21, 22. 22 stitches will be enough. Now redistribute them between three needles or I forget to cast on one more extra stitch for joining in round but okay I will do it later more or less evenly now cast on one more stitch, so in total 23. And now let's join and knit in stocking stitch in rounds. Slip the first stitch to the right hand needle. And now with the tip of left hand needle pick up the last stitch and pass it over. Now return first stitch to the left hand needle. Take a needle and start knitting in stocking a stitch, so knit all stitches around. Need the second needle and the third one.
perfect go on knitting until you reach desired length it's about 10 or 11 centimeters here i am that's what i have let's measure it so i've done 11 centimeters the width here almost six if you need it now cut the yarn and leave a long tail do not bind off stitches we don't need to do it now using a yarn needle a tapestry needle slip all stitches First needle, second needle, and third needle. Now just pull tight to close hole and from the other side start rolling. Don't weave this tail. Just place it this way and start rolling. In this way like this let's attach it so that's what I have I've done this to one I added four stitches so I cast on 58 stitches and it's a little bit bigger and will fit baby up to nine months for sure so using tail attach this knot here in the center I will not show how to do it I'm sure you can do it yourself and of course if you want to decorate your turban with a bow you can crochet it you can knit it you can also add knitted flower or crochet flower so you decide how to decorate or a button big beautiful button thank you guys so much for watching this tutorial with me i hope you enjoyed it please don't forget to subscribe to my channel like this video leave me comments if you have any questions check the written instruction on my blog and i will see you soon bye